pressure, you got it. I got it. Oh. Alright, fighthype.com are here with one of the most underrated lightweight champions in boxing history, El Temible, Jose Luis Castillo. So Jose, a lot of people, they when they think of you, they think you're the man who deserved to beat Floyd Mayweather. When you look back on those two fights, do you think you beat Floyd Mayweather? Eh, yo pienso que sí. Eh, el boxeo, como he dicho el día de precisión, lo fue se en otra pelea, pero todo el mundo vio que yo le gané a Mayweather. Oh, o sea, I, I, I didn't know. Oh, I didn't know. Okay, so he's, he's saying that um, everybody saw that he won to Mayweather. And, but the three judges, they saw different, but I mean, he, all the people know that my dad won that fight, you know? What, what was it about your, how you fought in those fights that was successful? What did it take to beat Mayweather? What was it that you had to do to win Mayweather? What was it that you had to win Mayweather? To be on top of him, not let him think, because he's a very smart boxer, and I didn't let him think that he's always on top of him. Yeah, just applying some, uh, so much pressure, don't let him think that much because he's so smart, he's so um, slick, so that, that was the, the, the key. Put some so much pressure on him and, and to not not uh, get on his game. Was it your timing? Because so many fighters try to put the pressure on, so they can't even win two rounds. But you, what was it about your pressure that was effective? Si que que la diferencia entre tú aplicando esa presión a los otros peleadores que habían aplicado esa presión pero que no les funcionaba. No sé, o a lo mejor eh, nadie no había presionado tanto a Mayweather, fui el primero y se puso más, eh, más inteligente ya cuando se hicieron presiones ya, ya los había estudiado. ¿no? Yeah, um, probably the, the pressure that I brought to him, uh, he never saw that like before, so maybe that was the difference. Who was the, the better fighter, the greater fighter? Chavez when you would spar him in his prime or Floyd Mayweather? ¿Quién era mejor? ¿Chávez en su, en su prime cuando lo estás haciendo sparring o Floyd Mayweather? Son diferentes, los dos son muy grandes. Yeah, they are different, they are both great, but uh, they are so different. Were those the two best that you ever were in the ring with? Sí, fue, fueron los dos mejores que, que estuviste en el ring compartiendo. Yo creo que sí, dos de los mejores y me llevo esa gran experiencia de haber cambiado golpes con ellos. Yeah, it was it was uh, uh, an amazing experience to say, uh, share the ring with those both legs. So you also fought the greatest fight uh, since the 21st century, Jimmy Morales. Are you underrated? Ah, uh, que también peleaste una de las mejores peleas de toda la historia. Eh, que si piensas que, que la gente no te lo reconoce tanto como debería. No, no, si la gente reconoce y me y me dice que son las mejores peleas. Sí, yo contento, no contento de que reconozcan el trabajo que uno, que uno hizo. No, it has been recognized that uh, that was one of the best fights of the his, uh, history of boxing. So I'm, I'm happy with that. How do you look back on that fight in your heart and in your mind? ¿Cómo, cómo la recuerdas esta pelea en tu corazón, en, en tu cabeza? ¿Cómo, cómo la ves? No la, no la he podido olvidar. Parece que fue ayer la pelea, la recuerdo como si hubiera sido ayer. It's like uh, if it was yesterday that fight, I remember like super vividly. But uh, it, it is it is obviously uh, sad that uh, that I didn't came with uh, on top. But I, I remember it like vividly. Anything you remember about the rematch too? Where were you able to make it one to one? Algo que recuerdes de la revancha? No, nada. Fue una pelea relativamente fácil, no, pero una una gran pelea también. No, un poquito que duró. Yeah, it was a great fight also. Uh, it didn't last that long. Uh, I trained so well, but uh, but it was a good fight, the, the, the long that it lasted. Were you, uh, were you kind of uh, physically done by the time you fought Ricky Hatton? Was that the end of your time? Que si cuando peleaste con Ricky Hatton, crees que habías bajado tu nivel? No, no tenía, tuve problemas extra deportivos y no llegué al 100%, llegué, no sé, un 15, 20% de yeah, I was at my 20 percentage of uh, capacity. I had some trouble outside the ring, and uh, that didn't let me concentrate 100 percent on the last fight. But uh, it, it's uh, that happened. I know, I know, I touched on it earlier, but just last time on Floyd and Chavez, uh, you, you said you could say either one was greater, but who would have won head to head? ¿Quién crees que hubiera ganado entre Chavez y Mayweather? Buena, buena, buena pregunta, 
pero bueno, muy buena pelea. I mean, it's, it's, it's a good question, um, but I can answer, I cannot answer that.